Now this question was asked in gate 1996, and in this question, what they are saying is a binary search tree is generated by inserting in order of the following uh, integers, and the integers are 50, 15, 62, 9. Uh, sorry, it is 5, 20. Fifty-eight, ninety-one, three, eight, thirty-seven, sixteen, twenty-four, and they are asking what are the number of nodes in the left subtree and the right subtree of the root. Okay, now let us try to create a binary tree from this. So, if uh, the initial number is fifty, so fifty will be in the root. Then the next number is fifteen, so fifteen will be the will be in the left subtree. So next no number is sixty-two, so sixty-two will be greater than fifty, therefore it will come to the right subtree. Next number is five, so five is less than fifteen. Five is less than fifteen, therefore it will come to the left. Next number is twenty. Twenty is less than fifty. It is greater than fifteen, therefore it will come to the right. The next number is fifty-eight, so fifty-eight is greater than fifty, but it is less than sixty-two, therefore it will come to the left. The next number is ninety-one. Ninety-one is greater than fifty. It is greater than sixty-two, therefore it will come to the right. The next number is three. Three is less than fifty. Less than fifteen, less than five. Therefore, it will come to the left. Next number is eight. Eight is less than fifty. Less than fifteen, greater than five. Therefore, it will come to the right here. Then it, next number is thirty-seven. Thirty-seven is less than fifty, greater than fifteen, greater than twenty. Therefore, it will come to the right of this. The next number is sixty. Sixty is greater than fifty, but it is less than sixty-two, but it is greater than fifty-eight. So, sixty will come here. Next number is twenty-four. Twenty-four is less than fifty. Greater than fifteen, greater than twenty-eight, twenty, and less than thirty thirty-seven. That photo will come to the left here, so it is twenty-four. Okay. Now they are asking what are the number of nodes in the left subtree and what are the number of nodes in the right subtree. Okay. Now if you see the left subtree, this is the complete left subtree. How many numbers of nodes are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So in the left subtree we are having seven nodes. In the right subtree, how many number of nodes are there? There, these are one, two, three, and four. So there are four nodes. So it is seven comma four. Therefore, option number B is correct. Okay. So this question was asked in gate nineteen ninety six, and what they are saying is uh, a binary search tree is used to locate the number forty three. Which of the following probe sequence are possible and which are not? That means uh, in a binary search tree, they are searching a number forty-three, and we have to identify uh, which of these sequences are actually correct in when they are searching this number. Okay. Now let us take one one uh, all these options one by one. So in the option number A, what they are doing is they are uh, initially uh, in the root sixty-one is present, and then they search fifty-two. Uh, so this fifty-two should come to the left of it because it is less than fifty-two. And then they search fourteen, so fourteen should come to the left of it because fourteen uh, is less than fifty-two. Then they search seventeen, so seventeen should come right of this because seventeen is greater than fourteen. And they search forty, so forty should come right of this. And then they search forty-three, so forty-three should come right of this. Okay, so this is it. Is it is this sequence correct? So in this sequence, what we are doing is sixty-one. So uh, all this data is less than sixty-one. Correct. So then we are having 52. So all this data in the subtree are less than 52. Then all this data should be greater than 14. This data should be greater than 17, and this data should be greater than 40. Correct. Therefore, this is correct. So this is the first sequence which is correct. Now let us try to see the second sequence. In the second sequence, what they are doing is initially they are visiting the root which is containing two, and then because the three is there, so three should be greater than two, so it will be in the right. The next fifty is there, so fifty is greater than three, so it should come to the right. Then next forty is there, so forty is less than fifty, therefore it should come to the left. And then uh, they are searching sixty, but sixty should be greater than forty, right? And then they are searching forty-three, so forty-three is less than sixty, therefore it should come to the left. Now, if you see this complete tree, then you will find out that here uh, we search fifty, and in the left of this fifty, the sixty is there. Right. That means in the left subtree of this fifty, the sixty is there. But in the left subtree, all the data which is present in the tree should always be less than less than this fifty. Okay. So that is why uh, this sequence is actually wrong. So option number B is wrong. Now let us see the option number C. In the option number C, the root is containing ten. Then sixty-five should be in the right. 
then 31 31 is actually greater than 10 less than 65 therefore it should be in the left of 65 then this 48 so 48 is greater than 10 less than 65 greater than 31 therefore it will uh, come to the right of this 31 then there's 37 so 37 is actually uh, greater than 10 less than 65 greater than 31 but less than 48 therefore it should come to the left the next is 43 so 10 uh, 35 31 because uh, 43 is greater than 10 less than 65 uh, greater than 30 and it is less than 48 but it is greater than 37 so it should be here so as you can see uh, this is a valid subtree uh, this is a valid tree why because uh, all the data here which is present is greater than 10 then all the data in the left subtree of 65 is uh, less than 65 then all the data in the right subtree of this 31 is actually greater than 31 then all the data in the left subtree of 48 is actually less than 48 and then all the data which is present after this 37 is actually greater than 37 therefore this tree is correct right so now let us see the option number D in the option number D uh, they are searching 81 first in the root then it is 61 so 61 is less than 81 so it should come to the left then they are searching 52 52 is less than 61 and then they are searching 14 so 14 is less than 52 and then they are searching 41 so 41 is actually uh, is 41 is less than 81 less than 61 uh, less than 52 and it is greater than 14 therefore it should come to the right and then uh, they are searching 43 so 43 is actually uh, should come in the right of this 43 okay so this complete sequence is actually correct right then we are having option number e in the option number e they are saying we are having 17 in the root then 77 is there so 77 should come to the right of the 17 then 27 is there 27 is should come uh, 27 is greater than 17 but less than 77 therefore it should come to the left of this then 68 66 is there so 66 should actually uh, uh, greater than 17 it is less than 77 but it is greater than 27 therefore it should come to this place and then they are searching 18 so uh, 18 is actually uh, less than 18 is actually less than 66 therefore 18 should come here and they are searching 43 so 14 should be greater than this one okay now if you see this complete tree in this complete tree uh, this 77 is greater than 17 then this uh, all this data is less than 17 then all this data is greater than is not greater than uh, 27 actually because uh, in right hand side of this 27 all the data should be greater than 27 but if you see this 18 this 18 is not greater than 27 therefore this option is wrong okay so this question is asking gate 2007 and what they are saying is they are giving us some numbers and they are saying these numbers are inserted in that given order and into a initially empty binary search tree and the binary search tree uses the usual ordering of natural numbers then what is the in order traversal sequence of the resultant tree okay so let us try to insert these nodes so initial the first number is 7 so 7 is there next number is 5 5 is less than 7 so it should come to the left next number is 1 so 1 is less than 5 so it will come to the left next number is 8 8 is greater than 7 so it will come to the right next number is 3 3 is less than 7 less than 5 but greater than 1 so it should come to the right of this next number is 6 so 6 is less than 7 greater than 5 so it should come here next number is 0 0 is less than 7 less than 5 less than 1 so it should come here next number is 9 9 is greater than 7 it is greater than 8 so it should come here and then next number is 4 so 4 is uh, less than 7 less than 5 greater than 1 but less than uh, but greater than 3 so it should come here next number is 2 2 is uh, less than 7 less than 5 greater than 1 less than 3 therefore 2 should come here so this is the complete binary search tree which you get now they are asking what is the in order traversal sequence of this resultant tree so let us see what is the in order so what is in order in general case so in order is left root right so initially we are going to visit the left subtree then we are going to print the root and then we are going to print the right subtree so what will be the in order here so it is initially we are going to print this so 0 then we are going to print this root so it is 1 then we have to print this right subtree in this right subtree we have to uh, print this 2 then we have to print this 3 then we have to print this 4 and then we will come to this place so it will print 5 so then we have to print this 6 then we have to print this 7 
then we have to print this 8 and then 9 so now let us see which of the options is actually the correct uh, uh, option for this for this option is you see the option number C is correct so this was actually a uh, one mark question in gate 2003 so this question was asked in gate 2004 and what they are saying is the following numbers are in inserted in, into an empty binary search tree in the given order okay so this is the order which they have given and what is the height of this binary search tree okay so for this let us try to create a binary uh, search tree for this so the first number is 10 next number is 1 next number is 3 next number is 5 next number is 15 next number is 12 next number is 16 okay now let us see what is the height for this uh, so height is the so height is the it is the maximum distance of a leaf node from the root node okay so in this case what is the height so for this node the height is 0 for this node the height is 0 for this node the height is 0 for this node the height is 1 for this node the height is 1 for this node the height is 2 and for this node the height is 3 okay so therefore the option number b is correct okay now this question was asked in gate 2005 so, okay and in this question what they are saying is uh, they are saying that a binary search tree contains this number that is 1 2 8 and when the tree is traversed in pre-order then in each node printed the sequence of uh, which is obtained here so this is the pre-order of the tree and then you have to give the post order of this given tree okay so now let us try to create this tree so in this tree we are having a pre-order of this sequence so what is a pre-order so pre-order is 5 3 1 2 4 6 8 and 7 so we already know in the case of pre-order initially we are going to get the root node so pre-order is actually root left and right so we are going to get the uh, root node from the initial node so initial 5 is a root then all the data which is present in the left part of this 5 will be less than this because it is a binary search tree and on the data which is uh, right at the right part of this will be greater than this 5 so data which is present in the left is 1 2 4 and the data which is present in the right will be 6 8 7 okay now in this case if you see this 3 then this 3 is actually the next root so therefore uh, in this left subtree 3 should be there as a root and data which is in the left of 3 should be 1 and 2 okay and the data which should be in the right of this should be 4 and now in this case of 6 8 7 you see 6 comes before 8 and 7 therefore 6 is the root and therefore 8 or and 7 are greater than 6 and therefore they should come in the right of this tree okay now in the case of 1 and 2 if you see in case of 1 and 2 1 comes before 2 therefore 1 is the root so 2 is greater than 1 therefore 2 should come to the right of this okay and then case of uh, this 8 and 7 this 8 comes before 7 therefore 8 is a root so 7 should come to the left of this okay so this is the tree which we obtained now they are saying if the tree is uh, traversing post order then what is the sequence so let us try to give a post order for this given tree so post order is left right root okay so in there in this case we are going to get 2 1 4 3 7 8 6 5 so this should be the post order so let us uh, so this is uh, 7 8 6 5 so I forgot to write 7 here so uh, this should be the post order for this tree so for, let us try to match the option so it is 2 1 4 3 2 1 4 3 is in this statement and 2 1 4 3 is also in this statement next is 4 uh, 7 8 6 5 so 7 8 6 5 is in this statement therefore option number d is correct okay so this question was asked in gate 2006 and what they are saying is they are having a sequence of number which are between 1 to 100 in a binary search tree okay and then they want to search for the number which is 55 and then which of the following sequence of the nodes examined are not uh, correct okay so uh, sequence cannot be the sequence uh, of the nodes examined so which of the uh, in terms they are saying which of the following sequences is not correct okay so let us take the first option the first option they are uh, visiting 10 then they have visited 75 so 75 should be in the left right 
then they have visited 64 so 64 should be on the left of 675 then they have visited 43 so 43 should be in the left of 63 64 then they have visited 60 so 60 is actually uh, should come in the right of this 43 and then 43 and then 57 so 57 should come into the left of this 50, 60 and then they are visiting 55 so 55 should be in the left of this this so this is actually valid sequence because all the data in the right should is greater than 10 all the data in the left of 75 should, is less than 75 all the data in less than 64 is less than 64 all the data in the right of this 43 is greater than 43 then all the data in the left of this 60 is less than this and this is less than 57 okay now let us try to see the second sequence in the second sequence the first number is 90 so 90 is there second number is 12 so 12 is less than 90 third number is 68 so 68 is greater than 12 fourth number is 34 so 34 is less than 68 fifth number is 62 so 62 is greater than 34 next number is 43 so 43 is less than uh, 62 so it's 45 actually the next number is 55 so 55 is greater than 45 okay so this is also a valid sequence why because all the data which is in the left of 90 is greater, less than 90 all the data which is in the right of 12 is greater than 12 all the data in the left of 63 is less than sorry this is 68 so all the data in the left of 68 is less than 68 then all the data in the right of this 34 is greater than 34 then all the data in the left of this 62 is uh, less than 62 and all the data in present in the right to this 45 is greater than 45 okay now let us take the option number 3 c which is storing initially 99 and then 85 and then a 47 and then 68 and then 43 and then 57 and then 55 so this is the given sequence now in this sequence see if it is a valid sequence or not so in this sequence uh, all the data which is in the right of this 9 is greater than 9 all the data which is in left of 85 is greater less than 85 now for this 47 all the data which is present in the right of this 47 is not greater than 47 why because this 43 is there this 43 is less than 47 therefore uh, this is not a valid search a search uh, operation so option number c is wrong okay now let us see the option number d so in the option number d we are having 7 then 9 then 14 then 72 then 56 then 16 and then 53 and then 55 so in this case if you see all the data which is present in the right side of 7 is greater than 7 all the data which is present in the right side of 9 is greater than 9 all the data which is present in the right of 43 is greater than uh, right of 14 is greater than 14 then all the data which is left in the in the 72 is less than 72 then all the data which is less uh, in the left of this 56 is less than 56 all the data which is present uh, here after 16 in the right side is greater than 60, 16 then this 55 is greater than 53 therefore the option number c is wrong because uh, it is not a bad sequence